человека гениальный талант. Он играет так. Ну что он играет даже на двух инструментах, он даже умудряется с кем-то разговаривать в этот момент, когда он играет на двух инструментах. А мы его знаем, с кем он разговаривает. This is the six samurai, six trolley samurai. Он спрятался под очками. Он спрятался под очками. Nice to see you. How are you? Excellent. You're the big star in in Russia. You know that. Really? All the Russian girls they want you. And I'm not lying. Really? Yes. The Six String Samurai is in Russia. Six String Samurai was translated and then they, uh, they love this song. Really? Yeah, I'm serious. So take me over. Let's go. Okay. He want, now he wants to go to Russia. He wants to go to Russia and stay with me. Six String Samurai. I try to go to Russia and stay with me. I try to go to Russia and stay with me. I couldn't get a hold of anybody, and I can say Lance, his phone got disconnected. Ah, uh, he's got a new number. I'll give it to you. Yeah. So yeah. I just wanted to, I mean, stay in touch and like totally, totally. miracle that we were like. What did, did I? Oh, I met a lady that knows you guys. Yeah. She's a hypnotist, a Russian lady. Uh huh. Right off of Olympic and uh, La Cienega, and uh, I just ran into her. I, I was talking to her about hypnosis because I, I like hypnosis, you know. And then she said, oh, I told her about my film, I told her about the Red Elvis, and she said, oh yeah, they're my best friends, I know them. I said, you're kidding. And do you know this lady? I can't remember her name, though. She's awful. I have to show you something. I bumped into a guy, right? And he had a tattoo of yourself, of yourself. Of oh, Six String Samurai. Samurai. Of Six String Samurai, that promotion thing, uh -huh. when you like put the guitar and the uh -huh. sword, and the, the body holly glasses, uh -huh. he tattooed this. This tattoo, this big. You're okay, I'm not, not kidding. Let's go to my play. I'm gonna show it to you. You're gonna, you're gonna shit, man. Serious. If people That's like so that, funny. you know, and they're all dressed up like you, and like come to our show. Really? Yeah, so really. You, you don't, you don't know what you're doing, no. man. You're just, you did the movie, and that's it. So, right? Jeff. Uh huh. Uh, introduce yourself. What's your name? My name is Jeffrey Falcon, and I am the Six String Samurai. I was a Six String Samurai. <laughs> and so, what's your relation to Red Elvises? Uh, what we, do you know? We uh, we met like years ago in Russia. And we we got decided to like form a community to get married. You know, it didn't work out though because I'm not you know that way. But we ended up being friends anyway. And they came on board to do the music soundtrack for Six String Samurai, and it came out awesome, man. And so now we're down on the beach and we're boogieing on the beach. And uh, I'm just. Uh, Are you shopping for a guitar or something? No, no, no. I ran into this guy. His name is Levi. Some weird kind of funky space age Chinese guitarist. And I thought uh, the new film that I'm writing that now is called The Sword and the Flute. It's a mythological martial arts tale set in the futuristic world. And it's a very, very cool concept. And I want him to play a part in the film, just a guy on the street playing this spacey music. It's kind of going to be like Blade Runner, the idea of the film. Yeah. But with like ideas of like Matrix and Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon for the action. It's going to be really cool. And I'm so glad I ran into you because I was thinking about you and I said, I need to find Xenia because I want to talk to her about coming in to help me with the, the score. I, I got another guy that's doing techno music because I wanted to have like a techno feel to it, but I want some kind of trippy design for the music. You know what I mean? Great. Oh, you, man. <laughs> you know what? We wanted to talk to you. I want to tell you what you guys have done to us because all the science fiction freaks come to our show. It's really? fucking science fiction convention now. It's scary. Oops, no more mic. <laughs> Oops, is it okay? Just put it in the pocket. Or... Just, just, just throw it in the pocket. Okay. So, it, that's so weird. You got all these science fiction people like yeah. approaching you guys. Yeah. It, it's it. Is and, it uh, wild? Like, I mean, there's a lot? There are a lot of them. There's, people really take the film. <laughs> it's, you know what's so funny? It's like that film has got such a huge cult following from around the world. We got like hundreds of thousands of Excuse fans. me, I got distracted. <laughs> It, it, it's got hundreds of, yeah, and like some people saw it in the Philippines, we've got... The Japanese company flew me to Japan, I went there for the premiere, and it was so awesome. We had all these Japanese lined around the block, and they all had like the Buddy Holly posters for me to sign, and it was very cool. It was very cool, man. It was vicious. So why are you guys doing this? Why? Because we have a... We want to do something for the Okay. Like, uh, <laughs> something like from the film. That um, you should see. 
Elvis li Elvis alive. No, Elvis lived, Elvis lives, and Elvis will live. Elvis жил, Elvis жив, Elvis будет жить. Oh, it's just жил. <laughs> yeah, Elvis жил. Elvis жил. Elvis жив. Elvis жив. Elvis будет жить. Elvis будет жить. That's 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 close. Elvis будет жить. Elvis жив, Elvis жил. I did the best I could. Yeah, you did great. Thank you. Okay, Jeffrey Falcon, the six-string samurai. <laughs>